Hi guys, uh, welcome to my YouTube channel and I hope you like it so press please fingers under the video. Guys, uh, we discuss here trading situation, trading opportunities, but as I told to my trading club today in a video that I made for them, please be sure that you know how to enter market, that you know how to realize that this is the rebound, that this is the breakdown. If you do know how to uh, find it, so my videos with entry points will help you. But if you think that I tell you uh, some level and you just press sell, for example, there and price will go where you want to, well, it doesn't happen all the time uh, because, because you need to be sure that price uh, falls down under other levels. So uh, here is a complicated structure to understand and to realize that this is the trading moment. And if you do not know what it is trading, so please um, make rehearsals like you try to uh, try to act like you will trade, but not put your real money into trade until you do not know how to do it for sure. Okay, I'm here for a very long time, like 13 years already I traded and um, for many years I teach people how to trade, I help them to understand. That is why here I do these free videos so you do understand how I found some entry point and I will try to explain you more and more when you decide that you have to enter market. In my video for trading club this is the trading club for like five dollars a month uh, there are videos twice a, twice a week and some educational videos as well uh, where I give you some explanation like you see this situation and you see price going under this level and after that it goes up so this is the fake level for example that's what I give you in those videos and here for free I also will try to give you more explanations but please I know that you want to hear entry point, just sell and earn money. Please be ready to learn, okay? And after that, my videos will help you. I really want you to be cool in trading, but only if you are ready to waste your time on learning, on uh, making these um, tries. But I hope you'll make um, cheap tries. You will not pay money for those deals if you're not ready to trade good. So okay, now today we discuss some uh, we discuss some opportunities for brand. Maybe I think it's good. Uh, also, I'm not yes. I gave to my trading clubs the, the WTI, and there here is a brand, the WTI, some instruments that, that I think are interesting for future days. And I hope you are in plus with my trading ideas from last week. Uh, so the brand. Uh, what I think now is until price is above. 41.70 you're okay to go up to 45.50 uh, there was a gap in March and 45.50 uh, is a good level for price to go there but it doesn't mean that price will go there and stop there it might go even a little bit higher okay so mm, be ready to fix your profit but if price goes even higher above do not open new positions okay you have to enter market to open positions um, after price is giving you a correction and it's mm, trying to find more force to go up so yeah here if you see price being above 41.60 per 41.50 so above this tendency line you buy with the target 45.45 now stop my video and remember where i and why i give you this tendency line how i painted it how i made it here just made make the same in your terminal okay so yeah uh, th this tendency if it works for a brand tile so above this price you will be good to buy if price goes under 41.60 after that it will go up to 41 40 point half 40 and a half and under 40.50 40 40.50 price may go down to 38 so that's what I think for brand for future days. It's something that I'm going to work and intraday. I'm going to be ready to buy, to sell and to fix the result intraday, not to hold for a long time. And I also want to be with a short stop losses because I bought a brand um, and I, I, I got profit for 40.40 for here. That was the profit time after that I sold it stopped my short positions and I didn't buy it. 
So this uh, way up from 39, I was um, busy with the currencies, with the gold. Intraday, I didn't pay attention to brand, but all this way up, I didn't buy that. So for now, I am trying to find the entry point and to be uh, in a position with the short stop losses. <laughs> yeah, that's something that I want to do. Uh, about the Great Britain Pound versus Japanese Yen, look here. That's what I think is okay to work for a future week. I'm not sure when I'm going to have time for, um, maybe, maybe we'll meet on Tuesday actually, but I'm not sure about that. Uh, so for Great Britain Pound versus Japanese Yen for future week, please pay attention to this tendency that goes up. Here is a minimum price on March 18th. This is the first point. Second point, look here, second point, May 17th. And third point, it's like April 9th. With these three dots, minimum price, minimum price, maximum price, I make this channel, upgoing channel, what it gives me. Uh, first of all, uh, in this channel, you also can draw it. It's like FIBA channel with a 50. Uh, you, you, you make this line a 50% line and you'll have the same channel on MT4, MT5 and, and others. So um, here is this trend going up and the middle part of a channel, look here, price breaks this middle part, test it, and from here it goes up. It happens all the time. So yeah, for Great Britain Pound, for Japanese Yen, price is going up and maximum price is like uh, uh, the target for us will be near 141. Uh, when do we decide that we have to trade? Yes, it is good to pay attention to this tendency line that I wouldn't, I wouldn't exclude situation that price may go, um, for example, like here. 138.20 and from here it will go up to 141. So uh, if they break, if they break this tendency, I'm not going to sell. I will sell this currency pair only when they give me a rebound and they give me a signal on daily chart with candles. After that, I, I will sell, but not now, okay? So be ready if they don't give you uh, on daily chart a signal to sell. So do not sell wait for a new signal to go up to 141 why because this is the maximum price of our upgoing trend okay uh, also let's take new zealand dollar because the technical situation here is uh, kind of the same with the great britain pound with the japanese yen look here new zealand dollar it also has those three dots first one minimum price second one minimum price and third one, the maximum price between those two. How you draw this upgoing channel? You take the minimum price that you see on this chart. This is the minimum of 220. Then you take the minimum price so that upgoing trend didn't broke. So why I don't take this dot? Why? Because, well, why I don't do it like this? Because here, market broke this tendency line, so I don't need it anymore. It's, it's broken. Why I don't take this one? For example, I take first point and second point. Why? Because market broke this tendency line, so it doesn't work anymore. That's why we take the dot that wasn't broken yet. And the third point is between them. And with this technical picture, it looks like price may go up to 0.66, okay? When do we buy? Above 0.65, it is okay to go up with the target 0.66. But if price goes under this tendency line, under tendency line that I draw from May 29th, it may go down to middle side, look, the middle, middle area of this upgoing channel. I just show you with a great Britain pound with the Japanese yen that there was a middle side of the channel, the 50% um, side and price. Touch it, retest and from there it goes up. So here it's the same. If price breaks this tendency line, the red one, and it goes down to middle side of this, the middle part of this channel, from here it might go up. I hope you understand it. If you don't, please ask questions under this video, guys. And yeah, so for future days, you have level of resistance 0 0.66, 0 0.6640 that you may 
put like a level of the target where you buy to above 0.65 okay if they break this tendency line so you may work down to 0.6370 and from there you can buy okay thank you very much for being with me please um, uh, you are welcome to join my trading club and trading club pro as well all details about that um, clubs you can find under this video and um, of course i wish you profits for this week if you have questions ask them under this video see you later bye bye guys yeah and push these lights come on go